Misbah asks, can you say something about the religious conflict of present days, what to do and what not to do for the human betterment? Well, you got to focus on humanity than what came after. What we have most in common with each other in this life is our humanity, that we are all human beings. We have the same needs, we have the same fears, we have the same dogmas, all maybe different cultures, but we are bound to certain kind of conditionings. What has created our consciousness and programmed it uh, through our religion, nationalities that makes us feel that I am the best, my religion is this, because that's me, my nationality, I have to be proud of that, and I am different than you, my national. So these are all uh, things that we all have in common, good or bad, but these are all humanity. Then religion and other things, nationalities and so on, have entered afterwards. When thousands of years ago, uh, we were being, we were going through development, there was no nationality or religion. We were all sharing the same problems and same reasons for happiness and the same needs, food, shelter, security, and all that. So we had lots of things common. Nobody had other reasons to find himself or herself different from others. But then in order to create security, we created clans groups in order to be uh, safe from attacks from other people to take our food or uh, our woman or whatever it was thousands of years ago. And that very supposedly group unity created more insecurity when it was meant to be creating more security by saying, okay, there are two people attacking um, my a little home or my place to take my food so I have to now go find another person to be two against two then those guys said well these guys are two we got to be three so there were three and these guys were three to counter it so the groups became bigger the destruction power became bigger dangers became bigger then wars and so on created so for the same the, the reason that we started it all to be more protect protecting our interests and ourselves and have more security caused less security and that went on these groups created other mentalities and religions and rituals and they tried to be different through the customs and rituals and then the geographical area we belong to this so we are now this and they added that eventually became nationality and religions and all these started separating us instead of finding more things in common created division and now the muslim guy not all some think that oh i'm the best the jewish guy some not all think no i'm the best and the christian guy some not all thinks i'm the best and all these religions, all these reasons have become more of a thinking of that I am better than the other one because I'm different and everybody should be like me and cause them to create more of a visible differences instead of using that um, <clears throat> encouragement of all these religions, Islam, Judaism, Christianity and many other religions that they try to bring unity and harmony uh, through their teachings for people, they lost their main uh, reasoning, main purpose, which was that unity. Now they have created, they have been, they have come to be the reason for uh, differentiation, divisions and conflicts, and why they should fight with each other or be against each other in order to, um, you know, um, prevail on the other and so on and so forth. You all know the rest of it. And the nationality created the same thing. Oh, I am this, oh no, I am this. All of that has created all these new problems. And so instead of us focusing on what we have in common, 
which is being a human from human race and helping each other and living in peace and helping to create uh, protection against disasters, natural disasters, or maybe, I don't know, ferocious animals. Instead, we're fighting against each other, thinking that I am better than the other one because I'm from this nation and the other one thinks the same, or I'm from this religion and the other one thinks the same. So religions and all have caused many conflicts and divisions and they have not really helped the unity of the world and contrary uh, opposite to that has been its effect so therefore I think maybe that could answer your question that you say can you say something about the religious conflicts of the present days and this is what it is um, so if you focus on how to learn to heal people, help people, understand we're all the same, regardless of where you come from, regardless of what religion you have, it's all utter nonsense that you think because of certain religion or certain nationality, you're better than the other ones and that gives you the reason to destroy other ones just because you are this and you are that. Uh, that's your that's the illusion that you have that in that way you will become or you will um, prove that you're the best nobody is the best we're all in it together we're supposed to help each other and make sense of it all if we can't do that uh, then simply we have lost the way of humanity which is more important than anything else having lost nationality or religious beliefs those are all come secondary that's what I have to say about that, Ms. Bob.